Hello today, welcome again. We're going to see how we could type Greek letters in Inkscape. If you are in science or engineering, at some point you'll be using one form of Greek letter or the other. For instance, alpha, beta, gamma, delta, eta, and uh, mu, etc. So if you're doing illustration in Inkscape or in Adobe Illustrator, you maybe needed to type one of these letters if uh, that is part of the word you want to use. For instance, the word alpha semiclean or beta secretis or any other form of uh, word that begins with a Greek letter. So let's get started. So to do that, we open Inkscape and uh, I'll just zoom in a little bit so that we see what we will be writing. And we select the create and edit text object tool and we click on our empty page and here I'm going to write uh, how to write in Greek. Once you have the text tool selected, you can now go to text and you select glyphs and on the glyphs where you have here by default basic Latin you could then call the drop down menu and you go down and you see where there is Greek and Coptic. You select that. And after selecting this, you can now select the font family you need. In this case, uh, if we want sans serif, we select that. And here you have some formatting style, either by CSS or by face value. And if you go down now to this window, you're going to see different letters of the Greek alphabet. So you can use this arrow to go down and supposing we wanted to write alpha and beta, you go there, you select alpha and you go to append and you have it on your page. If you wanted to select beta, the same thing, you select beta, you go append and you have it on your page. So you now could write words like alpha Sinoclean or beta secretes. So that is it about how to write Greek letters in Inkscape by going through the text and going to the glyphs. And it's not just Greek letters that you can write that way. If you look in here, go down to the drop down menu, you're going to see other languages like Armenian, Hebrew, Arabic going down Bengali, Gujarati, Tamil, Telugu and going far down we see Bamum which is a language of Cameroon and several other languages which are found in there. So this gives you a possibility to write specific kinds of glyphs in Inkscape. Thank you for watching and please do not forget to leave your comments below or to give us a thumbs up and also let us know what we could do better in our videos. See you in the next video.